An ungrateful friend is that friend that will do anything for you just because they want to gain something in return. An ungrateful friend is that friend that will stab you in the back when you're not looking. An ungrateful friend is that friend that will sell out your secrets the moment you turn your back on them. See, the world is becoming a very difficult place to live in because of ungrateful people, because of ungrateful friends. I make friends easily, but I don't trust them easily. I have a bunch of friends, but I trust only a handful of them. There are two qualities that are common to ungrateful people. Be it a rich friend or a poor friend, they share these two qualities. They are arrogant and they are liars. A poor friend that is arrogant and rude is ungrateful. And a rich friend that tells a lot of lies is ungrateful. Most ungrateful people come towards or come closer to us when they need something we have. When they see something that you have that they are in dire need of. Or they just want to have what you have in order to compare with others. Ungrateful friends will come closer to you to borrow money from you, borrow a book from you, borrow shoes from you, borrow their dresses, borrow whatever thing they need that you have. And when they come, they come with all the tactics that they need to collect whatever you can. Be it flattery, be it telling somebody's other secrets to you, be it ruling like babies or crying like babies too, just to have whatever thing you have. When they come to you, and you give them this thing in good faith. When the time comes for them to pay you back, they will either start insulting you or they will try to make you feel ungrateful by telling you how ungrateful you are for not accepting that you are richer than them or you have it more than them. And just and by taking this little thing from you, you are complaining and whining as if they took the whole world away from you. They will complain of you being greedy, to complain that you are stingy, and forget it to know that they are the ones. You see, ungrateful people, one thing ungrateful people don't understand is the difference between borrowing and asking. They will come to you and, and ask you to lend them something. So they will never repay you back. When you ask them these things, they will tell you or they will try to make you to feel ungrateful. They will make you feel ungrateful by accusing you of being stingy, by accusing you of being greedy accusing you for not accepting that you are richer than them that god has blessed you far more beyond bounds and they are only trying to benefit these things from a good friend who does not want to give it to them to them you you are ungrateful you don't want to see them progress because you don't want to give them the little they want to get from you but the truth is when you borrow something from somebody you have to repay it back if you want help ask for help if you want to beg something beg for it Okay, if you need something, you don't want to repay it, either beg for it or ask for it. See, for ungrateful friends, they think that borrowing is a polite way of begging whatever thing you have. How is taking somebody's lone pair of shoes a polite way of begging? You know, how is taking half of somebody's hard-earned money a polite way of begging? Most of the times, ungrateful friends think that we don't deserve whatever thing we have. They think that we are overblessed far more than we need. Or, or they think we are greedy, we don't want them to have. But it's not true. We have worked for these things and when they come for them, they should either ask or beg. So when you have a friend that is ungrateful and you know that a friend is ungrateful, whenever that friend comes for you to borrow something, know that you might likely or not likely have it back. There are so many qualities that ungrateful people send out. So you need to watch out from these ungrateful friends, ungrateful family members, ungrateful anybody that's around you. First, they are full of deceit and greed. In fact, their modus operandi is deceit. Whenever an ungrateful friend wants something from you, they will start by trying to catch up with all lost time. They will call you in the morning to wish you good morning, wish you best wishes for the day, call around in the afternoon for chit chat, Call in the evening to remind you how grateful you are, how God has blessed you more than them, and they will tell you a bit of their problems. The next day, the same routine will continue, the same flattery will be poured onto you. And one skill they have is flattery. They will tell you whatever thing you want to hear at the particular moment you want to hear it. They will remind you all of these things and then bust out whatever thing they want from you. If it's money they are coming to borrow, they will look for a very nice way of telling you so that you will not deny them this opportunity. If, if it means for them to cry like babies, if it means for them to whine and do everything, they will do everything to have whatever thing they want from you. And once they succeed in having whatever thing they came for, they will fly away like birds to another tree. 
and they will only come back when a different set of problems come knocking at their doors and the solution lies in your pocket. Ungrateful friends are lazy and appreciative. Whatever thing you do to these lazy bones, they will never appreciate you. They will never give you genuine appreciation, but they will rather choose to flatter you all day long just because they want to have whatever thing you are. They choose to flatter you in order to hide their real intention behind them. Borrow a less privileged friend money who is ungrateful. When the time comes and you ask them for that money, they will be very rude to you and they will be very arrogant. They will try to make you look mean as possible. They will try to make others see you as ungrateful. They will want to transfer their ungrateful and negative energies to you. They will make whatever thing they took from you to look small, even smaller than the widow's mind. And if that person happens to have the money to repay you back, then you will have the insult of your life by the time they come to hand you whatever thing they took from you. They will remind you of how ungrateful you are. They will remind you of how bad a friend you are to them. They will remind you for being stingy, for being greedy, for whatever thing they can say at that moment. But all of these things are the way they feel because that is what they are. Ungrateful friends are materialistic and gluttons. They are never satisfied with whatever thing you give them and they know it all. They know the latest fashion design, they know the latest shoe, they know the name of the latest shoe, they know the name of the latest hairstyle, they know the name of the latest car, they know the name of the latest whatever that comes out, the name of the latest clothes, the name of the latest you know, dress that just came out, whatever new that is on fashion. These ungrateful people they know because they spend their every minute on Google checking out on the prices of things they cannot afford. And if they do afford these things, this money is coming from someone else's pocket. You know, these ungrateful friends, they plan on how to spend from another person's pocket. See, some of them even go as far as forcing you to buy a particular item which you don't want. But because you have the money, they will force you to buy that item so that they will come around and borrow that thing from you and never bring it back. These are people that will eat cheap when they are alone. They will minimize their expenditure to the minimum. And when they come to you, in fact, their credit card will go halfway just by giving them the starter meal before dessert is served. Ungrateful friends are always attention seekers. Wherever you guys go to, they will always want to get the attention. Even if you're the person spending all the money, you're the person with the car, you're the person with everything, they will always want to seize that moment from you and make it theirs. They don't hesitate. Ungrateful people want attention and they get that attention at all costs. But once that person sees the opportunity to gain everything for themselves, they don't care to smash you, they don't care to backstab you in public, they don't care to do whatever thing they want to do to get that attention for themselves. Ungrateful people will linger around you like counterfeited banknotes when there's a plenty to eat, when there is plenty of food, when there is plenty of everything around you. In your best moment, in your best season, when things are going on well for you. But by the time you get into any trouble, they are gone. They will fly away like palm birds to the next fruitful tree and come back when you arrive and ready for picking. With tons and tons of excuses to make it up for the lost time, with tons and tons of flattery to make you feel good and feel that they are your best friends. The best way to deal with ungrateful people is not to trust them too much and not to expect too much from them. Give them space and know that they will always be lies telling and know that they will always be flattery and know that they will always want to double cross you at any moment they have the chance. In this way you will react with them knowing that these things can happen at any time and when these things are about to happen you will obviously know. Always remember to call these ungrateful friends in times of a plenty where there is plenty to eat when there is a lot of merrymaking invite them these are moments they want make them come towards you only during this period periods when you have access to give out and let them benefit from it if you were to lend anything to them lend to them especially money the amount of money that you're comfortable with if they don't pay you back the amount of money that won't affect your day-to-day -day living if they don't give you back Give them sincere and honest appreciation and leave them to the consciences of their heart. Be bold to tell them to stop when they cross the line. Most ungrateful friends are deceitful, they are greedy, they are unappreciative, they are lazy, they are materialistic, they always want what you have and they seek attention even at your own expense. You can complete the list by leaving it in the comment section below how you think about an ungrateful friend or your experience with an ungrateful friend. See, there are only two channels on YouTube with this kind of content. This channel and no other channel. So, 
If you got something from this video, give it a like. If you need more videos, subscribe.